Which one kind of Hi everybody! Mommy, mommy, what kind of play? What? What kind of play? About the plays? Okay, just say hi. Mommy, say hi to everyone. Mommy, shiny. Oh, in the wall. Yeah, it's a sunny day. Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to another circle time. Mom, I'm just getting my car. Okay, come on. Cassie, let's go over the rules first before we start. Um, before I show this to you, I just wanted to say hi to our friends who are watching. Nika, hi. hi. Hope you enjoyed yesterday's activity. Mom, what happened? What? What happened? Okay, I'm saying hi to your friends. Um... Hello, Lily. Hi, Penny. Hi, Candice. Um, Benny. Hi, Cloud. Hi, Zach. Hi, Raina. And hi, Mason. And hello to everyone who's watching in the Philippines and Aruba. Good afternoon. So, let's go over the rules. Ate Cassie, can you please go over the rules for us? Okay. No thanks, not today? Okay. All right, friends. Let's look at the, our poster. We can sit during circle time. Oh, I think she's ready. Okay. Eyes looking. Ears listening. Mouth quiet. Hands folded. And legs crossed. Crisscross applesauce. All right. Okay, friends, let's sing your good afternoon song. You ready? Yeah. Good afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon to you. Good afternoon, good afternoon. Oh, how do you do? I am very well. I am very well. I am very well. Thank you. Thank you. Good afternoon. What's your name? Elsa. Oh, hey, Cassie. Elsa, how are you today? Uh, uh, not at all, Cassie. Oh, hi, Cassie. How are you today? Good. You're doing good. And tell us how old are you? Three. Three years old. Okay, friends. How about you? What's your name? How old are you? Three. Are you three, um, four, five, or six? I'm three. Okay. I hope you're doing well t this afternoon no. or morning, depending on where you are. All right. And Miss Cassie, please tell us today's date. Go ahead. Oops. What? It's July. Oh, my dear. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead. Today is fireworks. Oh, fireworks for July. Go ahead. Eight. Eight. Twenty. Twenty. Thank you. Today's July 8, 2020. Oh. And let's okay. find out the day of the week. Are you ready to sing with me? Mommy. Wait. Okay, crisscross applesauce, Cassie. Mom. Go ahead. Okay, sit down, please. Sit down, please. Thank you for sitting. Um, let's just wait for one second. Maybe our friend Cassie needs a little bit of time to listen. Uh, we are going to sing, Cassie. We're not using that right now. Put that away. We'll just open it up after circle time. Go ahead. Go. Put that away. I'm going to pretend. Okay, you're pretending. Okay. All right, friends. Um, Show me seven, and we're getting ready to sing. We'll just give Cassie a minute. She's not ready. Let's see. There are seven days. There are seven days. There are seven days in a week. There are seven days. There are seven days. There are seven days in a week. 
Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, <laughs> Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. All right. So let's find out what day of the week it is. Yesterday was Tuesday. Let's find out what day is it today? Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. Wednesday. Thank you, Cassie. I need you to sit crisscross applesauce. May I have this, please? Today is Wednesday. Put we'll put it right there on the side first. Put we'll put it on the side first. Okay, friends. Um, Cassie chose not to listen today. All right, let's sing. Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. That's what it is today. Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. That's what it is today. Wednesday. All right. Thank you so much for listening and looking at, on your screens. Let's see. I have a letter here. Tell your grown-up what letter you see. What Are you ready? Okay, what letter do you see? R. Okay, let's show it to our friends. Hold it for your friends. Cassie, hold it for your friends first. Thank you. All right, let's see. What letter do you see on your screens? Did you say R? That's right. This is the letter R. And let's go ahead and write the uppercase R. Take out your pointer finger. Cassie, take out your pointer finger. Thank you. I just do it to R. The uppercase R. So we'll draw a line, um, a straight line down. Whoop. And a little semicircle or half circle, a curvy line. Whoop. And a diagonal line going down. Boop. And oh, we just draw the letter R. The you want to what? I want to crush it. No, no, I want to cat. I want to eat. You want to eat the letter R? Oh no, she wants to eat the letter R. Are you a letter monster? All right, let's sing the sound of the letter R. The R says R. The R says R. Every letter makes a sound. The R says R. Okay. Now I'll be showing you two pictures. Are you ready? Tell your grown up what you see. What picture do you see? No. Have it. You, and you need to ask nicely. Mm -hmm. oh. Thank you. May I? May I? Have it, please. All right. What do you see on your screen? Okay. It's a picture of a jam. Good asking. How, how about this one? What is this a picture of? A robot, good asking. Now, let's think. Which one begins with R? Is it, may I have the jam? The jam. Wait, wait, we show that first. Thank you. Is it jam? Or, may I have the other picture? Or robot. Which one begins with R? Jam or robot? Tell your grown up. Did you say robot? That's right. Rrr, robot. This um word robot starts with rrr sound. All right. Would you like to show them the um the next set of pictures? Okay. 
Go ahead and show them the next set of pictures, please. I like kangaroo. Cassie, you have to show them the next set of pictures. And this one is not this one. Thank you. What is this a picture of, friends? Did you say kangaroo? That's right. This picture is a kangaroo. How about this picture? What is this a picture of? A radio. That's right. It's a radio. Which one begins with the er sound? Is it kangaroo or radio? Go tell your grown up. Did you say radio? That's right. Radio begins with a er sound. Er. Like you're angry or something. Er. All right. I like the way that most of you are listening. Great job. Now, let's see. We are doing syllables. Again, syllables are word parts. Some words have one syllable. Some words have more than one syllable. Okay, wait first. Are you ready to participate? No, mommy, too well. Okay, I'll just clap softly. You can sit right here by me. Oh, careful. All right. We are going to see... Which ones have one syllable or one clap? Cassie, can you clap for me? One. Okay. One clap. So it's, there you go. And then some syllables, some words have two syllables. Make two claps, please. Thank you. Pick a card. Ooh, you're such a great helper. Oh. Shell, or it's a clam. Clam. Okay, just wait first. Clam. Make one clap. <gasps> clam. Clam. Yeah. It only has one syllable. The word clam. How many claps did you hear? We don't say clam. We only say clam. So it's just one clap. Goes right here. It's my turn to choose a card. Whoop! I chose this card. What is this a picture of? Tell your grown up. Did you say starfish? That's right. It's a starfish. Starfish. Two syllables. Starfish. No. Again. Star. Fish. There you go. Starfish has two syllables. So we're putting it on this bail. Okay, is that the card you picked? Mm -hmm. Okay, what is it a picture of? A house. A tent. Ooh, we use it for camping. Tent. Tent. How many claps did you hear? Again, one more time. Tent. How many claps did you hear? One clap. Thank you. That's right. Tent. The word tent has one syllable. Put it right here. Next, our last word. Ooh, look at this. It, it, it is a bird, but it is called a seagull. 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 Listen carefully. See? Gull. See? Gull. No, see gull. How many claps did you hear? Did you hear one clap or two claps? See? Gull. Did you say two claps? That's right. The word seagull has two syllables. And this activity is finished. So, bye pictures. For the next part, 
again, we are going to show some fishies, and these fishies have different shapes. On the left. All right. Oh, what do you got? We have different set of shapes this time. It's okay even if you don't know the names of the shapes, as long as we are looking closely about um, the, the shapes that we see and the fishies that I show you, okay? So we have a trapezoid, oh sorry, triangle, a trapezoid, a parallelogram, and a square. Cassie, can you pick um, one picture, please? I want to pick the god. <laughs> Hexagon is not here. All right, let's see. Okay, Cassie, go match the fishy. Where does it go? Which fishy does, uh, which shape does it match with? <gasps> wow, let's just show them the picture. So this is the picture that Cassie picked. And she said... It matches with the parallelogram. Let's try to see. Whoa, yup, they have the same shape. So the fishy matches with the parallelogram. Nice job. Nice matching. Wait, with the other one. Oh. oh, these are the other pictures. The pictures are over here. All right, we're ready? Pick another card and show it to your friends. Okay, Cassie picked this fishy. Ooh, I wonder what shape does it match with? Okay, let's see. Oh, well, Cassie said it matches with a trapezoid. A trapezoid has like four sides, but the fishy she chose has three sides. There you go. Nice job. I like the way you did your correction. Look at this fishy, it's a triangle. Whee. All right, wait first. Our next picture is this. Whoop. Let's see what shape does it match with? Does it match with a square yeah. or a trapezoid? There you go, that's right. It matches point. <laughs> it matches with a trapezoid. Look at your fishy. It has four sides. And the trapezoid has four sides. Kind of like slanted. Uh, Woo. And our last picture is a square fishy. Let's see. Square fishy. Show? Yep. Thank you. Look at this. A square fishy matches with a square. Whoa, there you go. There's your trapezoid fishy, triangle fishy, parallelogram fishy, and a square fishy. Finish. Okay. We'll do that in a little bit, okay? okay. Now, up to checking the weather. Okay, go ahead and ask your grown up for help. Um, to help you peek out the window and see what the weather is. Go ahead. Wow. Okay, Cassie, I need your help. I need your help. Okay, go ahead. Sunny day. It's a sunny day. Mr. Sun is shining and it's super hot. How about um, in your place, at your place where you live? Is it a sunny day? She already, uh, I think the spinner is already pointing at the correct um, weather. It's sunny day and super hot. And Cassie chose this among these choices. Uh, we have um, three choices here. The rain boot, yeah, boots, mom. Mom. the beanie, and a swimsuit. And she said that for a sunny day, I don't know if you agree. We can wear this for any day. Do you agree? Yes, we can shorts? wear. We can also wear shorts, and we can also wear this when we're going swimming. We usually go to the beach or the pool when it's like um, summertime and it's super hot. Great job. 
And then, let's see what's on our gumball machine. Yeah. Let's sing a song first. One, Little, two, good singing. Little, little nine, little gumball, stand, little gumball. Ooh, Cassie said, well, she's super ties. So this is what she saw. All right, go ahead and count and tell your friends how many you see. One, two, three. Three, three. Did you see three? Three. Right there, are three gumballs. Cassie, may I borrow the cards, please? Which one? Three, three, three. Three, three, three. All right, mouth quiet. Thank you. Which one is number three? Is it this one? Or this one? Tell your grown up. Did you say this? That's right. This is the number three. Kiss your ring. Awesome. Now we have our activity. Yep. All right, wait first. Don't take out. Wait, wait, love. May I have it, please? Thank you. I will give you the cards. Uh, Excuse me first. Oh, yes. All right, we are going to play Little Fish, Little Fish. All right, let's see. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. I need a board, please. Excuse me. Thank you. Mom. Mom. All right. Okay. Now we will play the game Little Fish. Little Fish. I will put some colored sharks with numbers. Can you tell me what color you see? Okay, uh, the glitch. Uh, the light is glaring. Okay, here, maybe here. What color is this, Cassie? Friends, what color is this? Red. Red, and it has the number one in its bubble. How about this one? What color? Orange. Orange, and what number do you see? Two. Two, nice job. And go pick a card. Orange. It's in order, actually. What color is this shark? Yellow. Yellow, and what number do you see? Three. Three, nice job. Okay, let me fix it nicely. Next, what color is this shark? Green. And what number? Four. Four, thank you. Yeah. And what color is this shark? I want to talk about it, would you? What color? Blue, I would have a And five. number five. Oops, ah. sorry. <laughs> Blue shark, and it's number five. And how about this sharky here? Whoop! Purple. Purple. And what number do you see? Uh, six. Number six. Mommy, that's my favorite color. Oh, yeah, your favorite color. Let's see. Whoops! What number do you see? And what color is this? Uh, pink. pink. Okay. That's a lot of sharks. Yes, that's a lot of sharks. Maybe I can move it up because um, I have can I several like more cards. Can I like yes, I will. Excuse me so your friends can see. Thank you for helping me. I like Move it right here. Okay, sit down, please. And what color is this? Wow. Shark? I have Brown. nine. Number nine. Okay, we skip this one. What color is this? Dark blue. It's light blue. And what number? Ooh, put it right here. Ooh, I love the color. Wait first, we have three more cards, Cassie. Oh, All right, friends, what color is the shark? Black. Black. And what number do you see in its Ten. bubble? Ten. Oh, right here, bud. Oh, so we're going in order. Thank you. Look. Ooh, 
careful of mommy okay let's see excuse me what color is this shark uh white gray white. and what number do you see what number uh, is this oh this is 10 11, 11. good yeah. The last shark. What um, color? White. White. And what number do you see? Twelve. Twelve. What are the colors? Okay, go tell the colors. So Red, you're... orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, pink. Light. Oh, orange. it's aqua. Aqua. Mm-hmm. Eight. Uh, brown. Black. Pink. Black. Uh, black. Wait. Good job. Thank you. Now we are going to sing this. Not sing. Actually chant it. All right. There are our French sharks. Okay. And this is our friend, Little Rainbow Fish. We'll be reading a story about the Little Rainbow Fish in a minute. Wait, wait, wait. wait. wait, wait, wait. Cassie. May I have it, please? Hmm. Okay, for us to play this game, we need everyone listening and sitting nicely and waiting for their turn. All right. Now, again, this is the little rainbow fish. Yeah, the little that. rainbow fish will hide, will hide in one of the... Um, shark cards. Okay. All right. Now let's see. Okay. Let's see. Um, this is our little poster about the little fish. So this is what we're going to say. Little fish. I'm a little rainbow fish as sweet as can be. I'll hide behind a friendly shark in the deep blue sea. Okay. Can you excuse me? All right. Now I want you to close your eyes. No peeking. Okay. No peeking. No peeking. All right. Ready? Let's say this. I'm a little rainbow fish as sweet as can be. I'll hide behind a friendly shark in the deep blue sea. Little fish, are you hiding behind the... What color do you want to check? Oh, she found it. She checked the brown shark. And the little fish is hiding behind it. Okay, wait, Cassie. Cassie, wait first. Thank you. All right, no peeking. Close your eyes again. Close your eyes. Whoop. Sorry, I should cover this up. No peeking. All right, ready? I'm a little rainbow fish. As sweet as can be, I'll hide behind a friendly shark in the deep blue sea. All right, little rainbow fish, are you hiding behind the red shark? Nope. The orange shark? Nope. Yellow shark? Nope. Green shark? Nope. <gasps> oh, we found her. She's hiding behind the pink shark. Whee! All right, let's play one more, um, another round. Uh, I want, I want this one. Okay, you don't have to say it. Mommy will, uh, teacher will pick it, okay? All right, close your eyes. All right, ready. I'm a little rainbow fish as sweet as can be. I'll hide behind a friendly shark in the deep blue sea. All right, wait for us, Cassie. Call out a color. 
Little rainbow fish, mama, are you mama, hiding? Mama, are you hiding behind mama, the? Mama, mama, I'm being pretend. I'm talking pretend shop. Okay, are you hiding behind the what color should be checked? I'm behind the pink. Are you hiding behind the? Uh, the what? Which color? Uh, this one. Just call out the color, Cassie. Okay, mom. Um, I will choose a color. Are you hiding behind the blue shark? <gasps> no. <laughs> Are you hiding behind the orange shark? No. <laughs> Go ahead, pick a color. Tell tell me first. Tell me first the color. Okay. Uh, 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 excuse me. You need to learn how to wait. Okay. Which one? I see that. All right, I'll choose another color. Little rainbow fish, are you hiding behind the white shark? <gasps> there she is! There's the little rainbow fish. Let's play the last round. Go close your eyes, no peeking. All right, let's see. I'm a little rainbow fish as sweet as can be. I'll, behind, I'll hide behind a friendly shark in the deep blue sea. Okay, let me call out a color. Choose a color, Cassie. Wait for, okay, excuse me. All right, I think Cassie needs a little bit of um, a moment. All right, so the rainbow fish is hiding behind the yellow, excuse me, the yellow card. Let's see, there she is. There you go. All right, and this game is finished. All right. Okay. All right. For the last part, what we're going to do, like what I said, we'll be reading a story about the rainbow fish. Okay. Again, like fish, they stay underwater unlike mammals. Yeah. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. uh, use your words. Are you ready? Yes or no? Yes. Okay, thank you. Mommy, I'm not good. Okay. You a bad teacher. Okay. Are you a bad teacher? All right, let's see. This is the cover of our story. And this is, um, the title of the book is The Rainbow Fish. And it's um, written by Marcus Fister. Let's see. Look at the rainbow fish. I wonder why it's called rainbow fish. I know that a rainbow has different colors. Ooh, just like this one. Look at the scales. It has different colors, right? So let's find out what happened to the rainbow fish. Mommy, can I? Okay. All right, opening the page. Hey, look at this one. The rainbow fish was the most beautiful fish in the sea. But he never played with other fish. I'm too beautiful, he thought. So look at what's happening. Look at the other fishies in the ocean. And this is, ooh, the rainbow fish. Mom. He thinks he is so beautiful. Okay, I want to help you. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. All right, let's see. Ooh, look at the rainbow fish. Uh, so pretty. Mom, can I touch it? Okay, yes. Oh, Wait one second. There. <laughs> there you go. Let me read this part. Once a little blue fish asked for one of his shining scales. 
But the rainbow fish just laughed. <laughs> Never, he said. After that, the other fish swam away from him. The rainbow fish was all alone. Hmm. Now look at the picture of the rainbow fish. He's right here. And let's find out what happened next. He went to the starfish for help. Why doesn't anybody like me? He asked. Go ask the octopus, said the starfish. She is very wise. Mommy's a bad guy. There you go. Mommy, so what did the starfish tell the rainbow fish to go to who? To the octopus. To go to the octopus. The octopus is not nice. Because he, no, he said the octopus is very wise. Mommy's no, not there. Ooh, you see Mr. Octopus? Mom, I don't see. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't Here. See. Look at the eyes and look at all the tentacles right there. Mom, I can see, I can see his rainbow. Oh, it, the octopus doesn't have rainbow. He's in his cave. There is Mr. Octopus. And this is the rainbow fish. Mom. So the rainbow fish, let's find out what happened. The octopus said, Give away your shining scales. You won't be as beautiful, but you will have friends. I can't do that, cried the rainbow fish. What did Mr. Octopus tell the rainbow fish to give away his what? Shiny scales. Let's find out if he gave away his shiny scales. Oh, look at that rainbow fish and another fish friend approaching him. Suddenly, the little blue fish was back. Please, he said. Could I have just one scale? Well, the rainbow fish thought, maybe just one tiny scale. The little blue fish was so pleased. It made the rainbow fish Feel happy. So, when the little blue fish asked the rainbow fish, he gave one shiny scale to him. And how did the um the little blue fish feel after he gave one? Good. Good. He felt good, and the rainbow fish also felt happy. Ooh, they share. He's starting to share. <gasps> Oh, look at all the fishy friends. There's the rainbow fish and all the fishy friends. Let's find out what, what they're doing. Soon, all the fish came, and the rainbow fish gave away his scales one by one. Finally, he had only one shining scale left. But now, as he swam off to play with his friends, he was the happiest fish in the sea. The end. Now, uh, what did you learn about the rainbow fish story? I want it. You, you like the story? How about you guys? Did you like the story? So remember, we are. it is always nice to share, okay? And maybe you can just take turns and ask nicely. All right. And we'll see you again tomorrow for another circle time. Bye. Have a great day. Bye.